UAE is leading the region in terms of aerospace uh, and also space. Uh, today, UAE has the largest space sector in the region in terms of number of satellites. Uh, we operate and own seven satellites. We have the first space agency in our region. We have the first Arab and Islamic planetary mission to Mars. Uh, we have um, three operators. We, UAE has become a hub for space services, space events, space education, and space capability. UAE government has uh, identified space as part of our current and future. In fact, we are using space as a bridge to the future. Through space, we educate, we inspire, and we educate, and we train, and we retain our next force uh, generation of engineers. It doesn't matter where they go. We inspire them through space. Then they can go anywhere. They can go to oil and gas, they can go to airlines, aerospace industry, or they can go to renewable energy. But we are using space as means to inspire, to elevate the expectation uh, and also to position our country as a contributor to the world uh, bigger picture, if you like. We have probably the longest project on Earth. We have a 100-year project. We call it Mars 2117, which is 100 years from today. So the objective, by that time, UAE will contribute to put the first settlement on Mars. So that's a vision. We are using this project to educate, to network, to bring technology and knowledge to the country. Why? Well, this country facing some challenges, similar to Mars. We have lack of food security, water security, energy challenges, and also environmental challenges. These are the problems and challenges of Mars. We are using Mars and the collaboration to find the solutions to our current challenges here on Earth.